All righty, ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to the third and final part of Thanksgiving Pro Tip. So our third and final portion is I'm going to show you guys how to break a turkey down. It's very similar to breaking down a chicken. This will help your turkey cook faster if you don't want to deal with all the bones and the jostling around of the turkey in itself. This is a quick and easy way to break down a turkey. You can put it on the pan. You can smoke it, you can grill it. I mean, the options are much more versatile if you do it this way. So I have my chopping board here and I've taken the liberty to go ahead and put some plastic wrap down, okay? So in our last video, you guys seen me marinate the chicken, right? Now, I mean, the, the turkey. So now what we're gonna do is we're gonna take our turkey, we're gonna take it out of our bag, okay? Now we're gonna start simple and easy with this. We're gonna, first thing we're gonna do is we're gonna take off the, the wings, okay? Now, depending on how you like your wings, you know, you can either go the whole wing or you can go half. So really, what you're gonna do with the turkey, you're gonna open the wing out, take it, snap it, and this way you have the joint exposed and this way you just cut right through it, okay? So you have the wing there, you can take off the last wing if you like, okay? And then when it comes to this inner joint, same thing basically, you're gonna cut around it, okay? Don't pop it. Exposing the joint. Okay, and then you just simply cut right in between the joint, and there you go. Okay, so you're gonna turn to the other side. Again, you're gonna spread the wing out. Cut it down, pop the joint. This way it's exposed, cut, and there you have it. Now when you have it on the side, same thing here. I'm gonna just kind of cut around it. Okay, pop. And there you have it. And of course, if you're a little squeamish, you know, of course, you can put on gloves. Okay, now. We're gonna go ahead and open the whole thing up, okay? So now everything's exposed, okay? Now to make this easy, so now you have the legs and you see how it's a little flexible? You're gonna simply cut that skin, okay? And you're gonna follow it all the way around, okay? Get it up against the turkey. And then the same thing, you're gonna pop till you get that bone out. That way you know exactly where to cut. Okay. Now here, when it comes to the actual turkey leg itself, there's kind of a road map. That road map will tell you exactly where to cut. Okay, this way you don't have to damage your knife or go through bones. Now you have a beautiful thigh that you can put right on the grill or smoke. You have your leg. Okay, I'm gonna turn to the other side. And of course you're gonna get some dripping, so just make sure when it's all said and done that you sanitize your countertop you know, well, definitely get some bleach in there. Get that cleaned off, okay? Again, cut around it, get that bone to pop. Okay, thigh and leg. 
Again, you have that road map there. Okay, leg, beautiful thigh. Okay, now the only thing you're really left with is the two breasts. Now, I'm gonna lay it down so you guys can see it, but directly down the middle is where you have that breastbone, right? So you're gonna go to either, you're gonna go right on either side of that bone, okay? Now using your fingers as a guide, but make sure and keep your fingers out of the way. You're gonna go right up against that center breastbone. Okay, making an incision. And of course, pulling the turkey away as you cut. Because you wanna get as much meat off this bone as possible. Okay, you have the breast. Beautiful. Whole turkey breast. And you see the loin is still attached. And as you can see, there's some bone left on here. Listen, you can roast this off, make a beautiful turkey stock. You can roast this off, let the dog have a nice Thanksgiving as well. Okay, now again, you have the turkey. And then again, just go right along the other side of that breastbone. Okay. Make an incision as you go along it. Okay. You can hear me scraping right up against that bone. This way you know you're not missing anything. Okay, and there you have it. Now the beautiful thing about this is you can go back and you can put your uh, turkey parts right back in the same marinade. Now you see here's the carcass that you have left. Again, you can roast this off, grill this off, boil it, make a stock, or again, you know, do this and let the dogs have a wonderful Thanksgiving as well, okay? So there you have it. All right, ladies and gentlemen, that's gonna pretty much do it. I just want to take this time out to wish you and your family a happy, very uh, Thanksgiving. Listen, everybody, no matter what you're doing out there this Thanksgiving, be thankful, be safe, wear a mask, you know, spend some time with the family, but let's try to be careful with it. COVID is real. Um, and always, ladies and gentlemen, be good to yourselves. I love you guys. Thank you so much for your support.